as someone whose life revolves around nature, being in the ocean, being outdoors, these recent times have been really hard for me. I've had a deep connection with nature and I felt that starting to slip away with all that's going on in the world. I'm noticing myself becoming more and more reliant on my devices. I'm definitely not in a good headspace and I know I'm not the only one that feels this way. I need to escape, to get as far away from the city as I can, to find a better way of living. It felt incredible to be able to just jump in my car and to really immerse myself with nature. To feel small and humbled in these beautiful open spaces. There's something special about that and something that really speaks to me. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh. Oh, nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thanks for having me. Welcome to our family. Thank you. Walking with the elders and Chinkwa into the village was really incredible. I had no idea what to expect. Hello! Hello! <laughs> You guys live in harmony with nature and I really would like to learn from you guys how you live together with nature. Being out here, man, it's pretty amazing to see them with your own eyes, like in this unbelievable heat. There's no water anywhere, there's not much shade. Surviving completely off the land, like. What am I looking for? Watering? Yeah. So if there's no water, you can, you can drink nice <laughs> 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 You know, at home you just go to the supermarket and choose something. In a way, they're also choosing things, but it's very specific. They're only choosing what they need. They're not taking 10 or 20 things, they're just taking one route for water and, and that's it. Their whole lives revolve around nature, uh, around the seasons, and they have such a strong connection with it. Something I think that we've lost. To see people living so closely and so connected is really special. Uh, 
In our modern lives, we tend to live in very small groups or on your own. To see them living as a community and how happy they are and how connected they are to each other was amazing. Definitely a lesson I will take back with me. Oh wow, thank you. Wow, thank you. Thank you so much, that's so kind of you. Thank you so much for having me, I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. You know, at first I wasn't convinced that people could live this way. You know, I started to realize that this is how people have lived for thousands of years. And this trip really made me realize how important it is to take care of our planet. Not just for future generations, but for our own mental well-being. It was the first time in a really long time that I felt free again. I called some of my friends and really wanted to connect with them and share this incredible experience that I'd had. You know, as human beings, we need to be out here, away from it all, even just for a little while to learn how to live again.